Qui-Gon was one of the more recent Jedi Masters to rediscover the ability to manifest themselves in the realm of the living via the method known as Force Ghost. Whilst not perfected before his demise to Darth Maul, Qui-Gon was still able to communicate post-death via his voice without the iconic projected image Yoda and Luke Skywalker used to some extent. However, at the beginning of Episode 3 of Kenobi, we see Obi-Wan attempt to communicate with his master, Qui-Gon, with no avail. Is Qui-Gon purposely ignoring him because his Padawan failed to fulfill his dying wish to train Anakin? Well, no. Forced Ghost is a two-way street. Not only does one need to be in a particularly Force-sensitive area, the communication can only be done if that person is also somewhat connected to the Force. Obi-Wan cannot communicate with Qui-Gon because of how out of touch he is with the Force in his weakened state. But if he does succeed near the end of the series, we could see a Qui-Gon cameo.